What's up guys, Drew and I here, and it's that time to cap Mario Bros. 2. We appreciate you all who filed the LP so far, and if you haven't, here's a couple annotations to the earlier parts if you want to check those out. Anyhow, let's get on with the final journey, the final voyage, to the end of Subcon. Yeah. Yeah, mm, that's all Drew has to say. <laughs> well, right now, this actually... This is actually my favorite level of World 7 because I actually figured out something that, uh, not, I don't know if many people knew about it, but there's like this trick if you jump at the right time a little later in the level, you can just skip over this one part that's a real pain in the ass. Mm-hmm. And now, man, that was lucky. I didn't even know that mushroom was there. I knew the mushroom was, uh, a little over to the right here. So and there's another mushroom down at the other end. There are two mushrooms in this one strip. Are there? Yeah. Because I, d I didn't get this other one over here. No, in the other direction. Oh, okay. In the opposite direction, I should say. Okay. But yeah, um... Up, up and away! And here's world 71.5, I guess. Here's the little trick I was talking about. Uh-huh. Now, what you're gonna do here is just kind of boost, and you jump off that guy's head as he jumps. Just don't and jump too far, you'll kill yourself. Pretty much. You're able to skip over that entire wall and, and that, that, go up that ladder there. That part's a real pain in the ass. Mm-hmm. I was just messing around one day, and I'm like, cool. Yeah, that's certainly a convenience to find. And almost got hit by oh, that guy's balls there. Giggity. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Now, there are, I think there's one other one I found, but I can't remember where it is. It's not in World 7, I think it was like in World, maybe 1. Are you talking about the walls you can jump over? Yeah. Oh. Do you know about all the others? Um, no, just the one that we just got to. I think there's like one or two others, but I'm not sure about that. Okay. When I've been perusing YouTube and... Mm -hmm. One bonus chance. Yeah, that's about it. So, here we go, folks. Oh, World 7 2. Yep. This is. Wart's Castle. Wart's Castle. No, wait, hang on. Yeah, I kind of uh, screwed that up there. Wart himself's castle. <laughs> Alright, so we enter this castle on a conveyor belt, apparently. That doesn't like you. Yeah, apparently not. It's a bomb, some... You Pan Pansy Panzersons, or whatever they're called. Yeah, we call them Pansy Panzers. They're just called Panzers, but... And anyhow, yeah, the credits will be coming up here, and we'll be able to... Uh, just identify, you know, the names of the monsters, and, you know, see where we were right and wrong, and yada yada. Yep. And we hoped, uh, I'm going to be doing uh, Mighty Morphin Power Rangers very soon. So, look forward for that. Mm -hmm. And now this part of the room, castle, whatever, it's kind of tricky. I used to never be able to get past that as a kid without losing probably at least one life. Uh, as I got older, you know, I kind of got to do it without uh, just taking, you know, one heart. Uh, now, as you can see, it's uh, just got a lot gotten a lot easier do you even have to come down this set of ladders nah but if you come all the way down here you can get the mushroom of this level all oh, right i forgot about the mushroom this is the only one in 72 that i know about so if anyone wants to like yell out and uh put in like hey you know there was one at i don't know like 6 you know, so-and-so, something like the time, and just, you know, kind of explain, you know, where we missed it. <clears throat> but if there's a potion, isn't there usually a, uh, a mushroom? I mean, once you have four, obviously you can't get any more. Mm-hmm. Unless you hack or something. Mm-hmm. Yeah, pretty much, but I think it's probably, um, in one of the, uh, the, uh, like optional rooms that you can kind of just kind of explore rather than just you know taking the you know path just straight to a wart. Oh crap. Yeah, these guys are just annoying. And I think I almost die right up here. 
Oh my god. No, no. Okay. Just made it, so. So, yes. And now, as you can tell by that music, guys, we are drawing near to Wart himself. Yeah, yeah. Just remember, you got a duck right here. So you got these two that. Three. My bad, that come and try and kill you. I think they might like Peach. Like, they like like her. I don't know about that, but guys, here's the final Birdo. Thankfully, he's red, so. But there's nothing else to throw at him, so he has to be red. Pretty much. And, is that what I think it is up there? The, uh, Banto is his name? The mask thing that's hovering there. Is he gonna have to chase us again? Oh my god, here we go, guys. Oh my god. This is not Run! fun. Wow, look at that. One time I was playing this and he killed me right as I went in the door. Really? Yeah. Or right before he went in the door. I opened- I, I had the door unlocked and he killed me. Oh my god. I was just pure unluckiness. I don't think unluckiness is a word. Well, I don't know, but guys... Welcome... To Wart's Lair. Apparently Wart likes, uh, blocks. Yeah, apparently so. And he likes masks. And apparently he has deadly bubbles that he spits out. <laughs> yes. It's like... He actually looks like Bowser's cousin or something. <laughs> it's like, where's his, like, sword and shield? I mean, it should be like Ocarina of Time. It should be like... What, is he Ganondorf? No, it sh he should be Link. It would be like... Wart, you should first equip a sword and a shield. What? You already have deadly bubbles? Well, good grief! Oh. I always, when, I, when my brother used to play this, I'm like, I always thought that Wart was Bowser's cousin or something. Bowser was like... No, he's just a, a main uh, antagonist. But has he of... ever come back in any Mario game? No, but he makes an appearance, guys, in Zelda Link's Awakening. On, the, on you know, regular Game Boy. Are, you gonna, are we going to be doing that at all? Uh, I'm not sure. I, I've never really gone through that game too many times, to be honest. I've only gone through- is that the game where you can get a Chomp Chomp to follow you? Where you have to use the Chomp Chomp to break, like, flowers or something? Mm-hmm. Oh, and it sounds like we have a fan call from Drew's mom. Hey, Julie. <laughs> oh, boy. Well, talk about a finale, guys. Oh, nope, he's back. Sorry, I had a phone call. Welcome back. Yeah, just ignore that. And just in time, I believe, right about here, yeah, so, I get hit. So like I was saying before, when I was a kid, when I was like, I don't know, my brother was eight, I was four. Yeah, that's right. And uh, he was playing this on the Super Nintendo, and I was, I asked him, is that Bowser's, like, this is it? angry cousin there we or go. something? Boom! Apparently he has a heart on his tongue. And he loses color. Apparently, uh, he doesn't like his veggies. <laughs> well, uh, Wart's weakness, basically, as they call, uh, as they say, is he can't stomach vegetables. So, yeah, sucks for him. He's not gonna grow up to be big and strong. Well, he's already big, but he might not be strong. Yeah, that's for sure. Apparently, he's a Pokemon now, because he has those crossed eyes. Contributor Princess all 20 times. Well, that's cool. I didn't, I didn't know that there were, you know, 20 levels and all. Yeah, I didn't either. But I love the ending of this game. Oh, yeah? Why? Because I just love this ending. Because it's one of the good endings of the Mario games. I mean, my, my favorite is All Stars. Um, All Stars, Mario Brother, Super Mario World. Mm hmm. And there you have it, guys. Mario taking a snooze. Apparently he has a blue nightcap with an M on it. Apparently so. And he sleeps and on a golden pillow. Apparently those last seven videos of this game was all a dream. Mamma mia. Posteria.
cast. Casteria. So were we right about some of our characters? Yeah, Mario's right. And apparently and Mario. Luigi. Oh my god. Apparently they're all transparent now. Yeah. I'm toad. So, Alright, we got Shy Guy right. Sniff it. Sniff it. I got I Ninji. That's a ninji? Apparently Bezo. Porcupo. I get it, because he's a porcupine. Tweeter. Bob um, of course. Poopstar. What's that one? Trouter. Oh, that's the fish guy. Pidget. That sounds like a Pokemon. Panzer. That's what Pidgey's called. Or Pidgey. Flurries. And Alba Albatoss. <laughs> Fanto. Spark. Subcon. Now wasn't isn't the entire world in Mario Bros. 2 called Subcon? Now this is ridiculous. Look at that guys. Birdo and Birdo. The one that looks like Birdo is named Astro. I think they messed that up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You think that Birdo looks like an ostrich? No. Mauser, Fry Guy, Claw Glip. Shouldn't it be Grip? A little uh, typo on Tri that card. Triclide. Clyde. And Wart. But he doesn't have any warts. <laughs> I think what maybe they're implying is he's like a wart, annoying and painful. So well, guys, ca catch my Mighty Morphin Power Rangers Let's Play. That will be coming up hopefully within the next couple weeks. Cause my schedule's kind of tight. Yeah, and, and guys, stay tuned for more of my Fire Red LP. And uh, what Drew's gonna do here tonight is uh, more recording for his Mega Man X videos. And uh, yeah, stay tuned for those. Thanks a lot for watching, and we'll see you guys next time.